Hey YouTube, welcome back to a brand new Animal Crossing New Horizons video. Today we are taking a look at some fence types that appear to have been removed from New Horizons. So without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. So as I'm sure you know by now, whether you've played Animal Crossing New Horizons yet or not, a huge feature added to the game is fences. Fences are a kind of half tall, half furniture item that we can literally use to build all kinds of different fences pretty much anywhere around our islands. Fences dramatically change the look of our environment and allows us to really step up our exterior design and landscaping skills. For the first time in any Animal Crossing game, it's super easy to fence off play areas, create dedicated pathways and even section off villager houses to make gardens. It's really awesome. Currently at the time of making this video, there are 19 different fence types, including the Kural, the Vertical Board, the Country, the Spiky, the Barbed Wire, the simple wooden fence, the lattice, the imperial, the brick, the stone, the iron and stone, the zen, the rope, the iron, the wedding fence, the straw, the hedge, the bamboo lattice and of course the rather fun bunny day fence. All these fence types can of course be used to build fences and at least three of them have been added in updates since the release of New Horizons and I'm pretty sure even more will be in the future. For example, we'll probably get a Halloween themed one in October. But what about some of the fences that have been removed? Well, it seems that at least three fences or fence types have been removed from New Horizons. Of course, we'll use the term removed very loosely as I guess there's a chance they'll be made available in the future, but more on that later. So the first fence that appears to have been removed from the game is this cute little white picket fence that was first shown in the original New Horizons reveal trailer. As you know, since we just went through all the fence types, this no longer exists in the game and as far as we know cannot be obtained. There's a couple of possibilities with what's happened here though. The first is that the white picket fence shown in the trailer was in fact the simple wooden fence given they're both identical, but without its texture. This is completely feasible given the trailer gameplay was recorded with a demo version. The second is that fence customization was or is planned to be a feature in a future update and it's actually a customized simple wooden fence customized to white. Or it was its own fence type and was simply removed. But what do you think is the reason we cannot find this fence in New Horizons? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Moving on, the second fence that has seemingly been removed is the creamy white lattice fence, which can be seen in this promotional artwork from the Animal Crossing website. You can see it just behind Julian across the back of the artwork and along the cliff top to the right. Again, for some reason, despite it being in the game long enough to create some promotional material with it, this fence simply doesn't exist in New Horizons anymore. Much in the same way as the white picket fence, there's a few reasons why. It could be the lattice fence, which we know about without its wooden texture, or a customized version with the color customized to a creamy white, or the obvious, the fence was in the game, but was removed before launch. Personally, I think seeing two fence types that look different in trailers and promotional artwork gives weight to a fence customization feature being available in the future, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. The final fence that cannot be found anywhere in New Horizons is this fence, which we'll call the Wooden Rail Fence. This is of course another promotional piece of artwork which can be found on the Animal Crossing website. Unfortunately, this particular fence hasn't been seen in any gameplay as far as I know, but clearly the fence model exists and is familiar enough to the developers and artists to feature it in some promotional material. So unlike the first two fences, the Wooden Rail Fence has been removed altogether without a trace. Out of the 19 available fence types, I couldn't even pick one that closely resembles it. So despite having 16 fence types at launch and three additional fences added in recent updates, it seems that the white picket fence, the creamy white lattice fence and the wooden rail fence as we're calling it appear to have been removed from New Horizons. Of course, there's a chance we'll see these fences eventually added to New Horizons either through an update or as we touched on earlier, a fence customization feature should it be added. But what do you think happened to these fences? Will we see them at a later date or were they unfinished fence types in an earlier version? Let us know what you think in the comments. Anyway, for now, that pretty much wraps up this video. I thought it was quite an interesting topic to see some of the things that may have developed into the launch game but seem to have been removed. So I hope you guys found it fun. 
Anyway, if you're an Animal Crossing fan, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any New Horizons news. Until then, I'd like to give a special thank you to this channel's Patreon supporters, as well as this channel's members. You guys absolutely rock. Don't forget to head over to our Discord server too. And of course, if you got this far in the video, please comment Fens. Just to let me know you did, that would be super awesome. And please be sure to include what Fens type is your favourite in New Horizons. I'd love to know. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it entertaining. Please be sure to leave a like if you did. Thanks for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. Stay safe and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.